believe we know who this might be. For sure. I'm surprised you don't like a guy like this. This guy just gets on my nerves. It's annoying. Oh, Honcho making his way to the ring. Honcho so Hensley. He just don't bring any, any happiness and appeal to my inner person when he comes to this ring, Mr. Gandhi. Sure, you ain't showing signs of a little bit of envy here from Honcho Hensley, who is apparently just as much of a ladies' man as he is a dastardly wrestler for the most I part. I wouldn't say that, Mr. Gondry. Maybe, maybe he's not for the ladies, you know. He may not be playing for the home team, Mr. Connery. I don't know. I don't care what team he's playing. Ball the air. This ain't the 90s, so, I mean, the Backstreet Boys, that stuff's over with, so why has he still got bleach blonde hair on top? Well, I don't, you know, it don't matter how the man looks. It don't matter what team he plays for. What matters is what he does in this ring tonight. Well, we're going to see. We're about I, to find out. I guarantee it's not going to well, be good. Well, maybe not as dashly this week as it was last time we seen him. He seems to be making his fans out here. Opponent be making his way shortly to the ring. That's a little ACDC, Mr. Connery. You know who that is? Yeah, I'm well aware of who ACDC is. No, I'm not talking. I'm talking about. I'm talking about. You know the music. What is it? Star Search? Are you asking me? No, questions? no. I'm. I'm asking. Do you know who it is? Come in. No. I do not. Okay. We got JD done. We have it done. I don't Kevin Dunn. Kevin Dunn making his way to the ring here to do battle with Honcho. Honcho Hensley, Kevin Dunn. Should be interested to see how this one goes. Kevin Dunn has, has already done a lot in the short time he's been here, Mr. Connor. He has. This is our second time seeing Ohancho here. This contest is scheduled for one fall. First in the corner by right. I wouldn't mind if it was our last time seeing Mr. Honcho here, Mr. Kevin Dunn! Seems to be a bit of a mixed response to both individuals this yeah. week. I'm, I'm not, not necessarily sure where, they, where they're they going with this. I'm not sure the crowd knows who to root for. The but, crowd definitely has its picks. And, but, but we'll probably get a good contest regardless of who the fans are cheering for out exactly. here. As Dunn's going to do battle with Honcho. The playboy Honcho Hensley. Playboy. Well, Dunn trying to get the crowd fired up. And it's working for a good hunk of it. Meanwhile, Honcho got his own little crowd of uh, fans here. Doing the Rick Rude, it looks like. Maybe that should be a new viral dance. Call it the Rick Rude, right? You yeah. May, yeah, yeah, you remember Rick Rude, right? I remember Rick Rude very well. You remember well. how Rip Rick Rude was? He was, Mr. yes. Mr. Hensley or Hensley or whatever you said is not. You know, Honcho got a little bit of time to go in the gym. I just don't think that I would do it. I don't think somebody that size should do it. I don't think somebody my size should do it. Well, he may have to. So, uh, he may have talked to King Jimmy about that. Because King Jimmy does one of those. Yeah, he gets the pass. That's the only pass. Well, he is the king, right? <laughs> Meanwhile, Dunn got the uh, arm in a bad way here on old Honcho Hensley. This one here could be a pretty scientific contest, you know. And I said that with a stutter. The cook contest. It's been a long night already here in Walling. Your humble announcer had a hard time calling that last one because it was breaking loose. You know, I'm never the same after G.O.D.'s in there because you always got to watch about Kilauea. Yeah, you, you always you always get a sense of fear and nervousness around them. Dunn better watch about Honcho here because it looks like his arm might be tore off if you don't. That's oh. why you don't get on this guy's good side, Mr. Conner. I've been trying to tell you that. Hey, I'm a humble play-by-play -play man. I call it down the middle. I don't show favoritism. 
Dunn don't show no favoritism here either as he's wearing out that arm on Honcho. Favoritism is key when you're dealing with individuals well, such as them. Well, we'll see. Running that knee into the arm of Honcho. Honcho won't smack the tattoos off of him. Honcho won't be doing that pose if he ain't got an arm. Dunn to the rope. Wow, look at that. Did the splits, the ducking. Honcho got hit in the face. I'm sure he loves that. Dunn, Dunn in the crowd trying to get Honcho to get in the ring. Honcho hitting the mouth, checking for blood. Maybe check for his teeth. Does he? Good Lord. He may have knocked his teeth. You know, it's kind of hard to get the ladies to call you back when you're missing a few teeth there. It's very hard. A man like it's Honcho, he's checking with our, our photography girl there at the ring. <laughs> need to worry more about the guy in the ring than the lady on the outside of the ring. Nobody wants to take pictures of him. So, I mean, he needs to worry about what he's got going on with Kevin Dunn because I wouldn't turn my back for a second on him. Kevin Dunn is a man you definitely wouldn't want to turn your back on. Oh, yeah. We've seen shades of that in the past. He'll rip your head off any way he can do it, Mr. Connor. Honcho got a head that a lot of people want to rip off for some reason or another. Yeah, definitely. Back into the row, boss slaps Dunn on the way out. Didn't give him time to see if he's going to break clean or not. That's not the way. That's not the way to do it. Uh, you play with fire, you get burned, and he's well, definitely playing. Honcho here, a little hesitant to lock up a Dunn. It looks like. Oh, now they're calling elbow tying up. Honcho pushing him back to the ropes. You know you're not going to get a good one out of him. Look there, he swings, but nobody's home. Gets caught with good another one. Lord. Rearranging the face for Honcho. He almost took his head off of that. He did. That right there will realign you gimmicks. First row might be taking some teeth home with him tonight. That's for sure. Honcho, I don't know. Million dollar smile might be more like a two dollar smile by the time. That'd be a 50 over. cent by the time we leave here. Might be needing some of them fake teeth off of Amazon you can order. Hey, you know. You can order those. So, I mean, we need to give him that link on Amazon. Yeah, somebody needs to get done off of him. He just hammered his head in for him. Yeah, he's definitely going to need them now if he didn't before. I think they're $16.95, by the way. Are you, are, you, are you getting paid a commission on that? Not yet. Oh, here they come, close to the table here. Watch the equipment. Watch everything. Oh, Honcho slaps the post. Wow, Dunn does not miss. And he doesn't miss that time either. Ooh. Honcho looking for a chair here. <laughs> like the man needs to sit down after that. True, he smacked that pole, Mr. Connor. Smacked tattoos off of him from the looks of him. Another one hammering him in there. Honcho down in the corner. Who could blame him? Looking like he's been at the cowboy up late last night. <laughs> he does, don't he? Yeah. Oh. Splash running, running avalanche, I should say. Dunn wants to do another one. It looks like he's about four Miller deep. Oh, nobody at home. Honcho kicks to the face. That's, I think he may have knocked him out. Nah. Honcho I, I think gyrating on the outside when he should be covering the man. Now he covers him. Foot on the rope, ref. There, there it is. Referee saw, saw it before a Miss Justice I was can't done. believe it. <laughs> The referee, he, he never can see anything. I think he's got a better track record than some of other referees. Yeah, yeah, the rest of them got glaucoma. He may just have a little bit of. Well, he may have a little bit of cataracts. I don't know. Well, he may be near side. Oh, oh look at that. Chopped to the throat here on Dunn. Dunn got chopped in the throat. Now he's getting. Oh, Good my Lord. goodness. What a spill. That one, I think he missed the apron on that. That one, that one took my breath away on that one because that looked rough. <laughs> Honcho falling him out there and taking a jacket back, apparently. I thought he, I thought that was his fan. I guess he decided he didn't want that fan I mean, I guess, anymore. I guess when you spend $25 on a jacket, you got to keep it, Mr. Connor. No, you got to at least cost that much to get that stuff on the back of Done now, fighting back. Honcho returning the favor. They better pay attention to the count of the ref. Up to six. He's on six. No, Dunn's back in at six. Honcho now, look out here. The man's not afraid to fly. We know that much. He's Here he comes. Up. Dropping the elbow. That may do it. No. No, it's going to take a lot more than that to put him away. Dunn is as tough as they come. Oh, yeah. Honcho's showing he's a little bit tough, too, now dealing with what he's dealing with. 
He's definitely got the advantage in the upper hand right now, but I don't see it lasting very long. Looks like going for a camel clutch sleeper type maneuver here. Got the chin wrapped up with it. Gonna make his humble, I do believe, is what he's going for. I believe that's what he's trying to Dunn do. not gonna be humbled easily. He's finding his way back up. Oh, Lord. That's not gonna end well. In that corner goes Honcho. Done now. Looking to follow up with something. Well, he gets caught. Push off from Honcho. Oh, that caught him. Oh, that oh. caught him. That could be it if Honcho can get over there and cover the man. Good Lord. He's trying. Did you hear that? I heard it. But not, well, that ain't going to work. Two count only. Elbow drive. Honcho kipping up now. Shades of Shawn Michaels. Oh, well, Honcho said we don't deserve whatever he's going for. Looks like he's gnawing at the angle here with some sort of a maneuver. Done. May not be walking by the time this one's done. Honcho raking, raking the back or something. Just out of my vantage point. You know, when he fell out of that ring over there, you know, he, he completely missed the apron. I know. It was a bad fall. It was a terrible fall. That's what makes indie wrestling so special, man. These guys go out there and put everything on the line. There's no mats outside of the floor. So when they hit, it makes tremendous impact. Speaking of impact, look at this. Good Lord. That was bad for Honcho, I believe. Oh, yeah. Whatever he went for, it didn't work out. Looked like a package pile driver got reversed Good by Dunn. Lord. The momentum took him over. Bad breaks there for Dunn. Or, not for, excuse me, for Honcho. Dunn's the one to come out on the better end of it. It looked, it looked pretty rough for both of looked them. Looked like, like a pile up on 108. Oh, oh good lord. This man may have a concussion after oh, all that. has gotta be it. He's been taking them beatings there of left and right into the head. Here comes another one. Oh, grab the rope. That's what saved the day on that one. A lot of fight. Still in done, maybe. Yeah, man's still kicking out after taking all those shots to the head. I think he's a strong individual. Mr. He's built to the floor. He took a number of shots to the head, and he's still I told going. you it's going to take a lot. He's not a toy with. Honcho sure. misses. Here comes Doug fighting back. Oh, Chest buster. Lord. That was an impact. That was. Both men now unable to do anything after the move. Referee starting to count. You got to count 10 to get up. Both men be lucky to make it. None reaching for the crowd support. Some people still chant for Honcho. I can't believe that. But hey. He has done good in this match so far. Mr. Well, they're both tough customers. I give them that much. They're both up, too. Here goes Honcho. He walks right into it. Close line takes him down. Tell you what, this could be the next big move, could be what puts it away. Oh, Lord. Draping him on the rope. Wait a minute. What's he dialing up here? The 931? There it is. Or is that the 615 up here in, in Walling? I'm not sure. I'm not necessarily Wait a sure, second. But, uh, Wait a second. Jennifer Morton making her way back out to the ring. But a man that size during a 619. We had seen her managing him a couple weeks ago. Yeah, what's, what's the deal here? She's out here costing the match right now. Good Lord. Honcho with a roll up on the distraction. He got the tights too. That's it. Can you believe that? Morton coming out here and Costner, ex associate of the match. She slaps done now. I guess that partnership's over. Here comes the king now. Wait a second. Was well, Honcho, Honcho helping G.O.D. out here? What is going on? What in the world? You is may have you, to join G.O.D. or you may have to start liking him. He's joining your boys in the center of the ring. So he's being, uh, I he's, believe, been, he's been Christianed by your king. Is good enough for G.O.D. now? I don't know about that one. Kilauea now making some moves in there. Got the man set up. The bell ring at DDT Blancy. Bell ring it ain't getting no nothing done. We need somebody else out here. So I guess Morton just severed ties with uh, Dunn. What in the world? And now she seems to be back in the honcho horse here a little bit. Can you believe this? I don't know what to think anymore. Can you believe the actions here by G.O.D.? G.O.D.? Actions by G.O.D. 
This is now my show. I'm running things from here on out at this show. Well, you hear that? time will tell. What the king has got to say. There might be other people got something to say about that. Stand for our actions and cheer for GOD and not Kevin's stupid job. Remember, you're unbiased. You can't be standing, okay? Well, it's hard not to stand for the king. Yeah. The king taking over the station over here. Thank you. He's taking See, over the show, Mr. Looks Curry. like the king's taking over the show. Hey, Jimmy, you're number one. I am. Number one. You are not a king. You're number two. As soon as we get this piece of crap out of our ring, I'll announce the next match myself. He's going to announce Now the next king match. now taking over ring announcer duties out here. Meanwhile, Dunn being helped from the ring. 